are tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Guys, we have done so many videos on this channel warning you of the danger of having biological men competing against biological women in contact sports. Someone can get hurt. It's happened before. And folks, I believe one day there will be a fatality because of all of this. That brings us to the NHL. Now, at the end of last month, I put up a video here on this channel because of some tweets that the NHL put out. Want to show how virtuous they were, how woke they were. They promoted a transgender tournament, folks, a transgender tournament of hockey. And in that, they, they had all of the virtue sitting in uh, statements out there talking about uh, trans women or women. Uh, non-binary is a thing, that kind of thing like that. I mean, NHL just went way, way, way over the top when it comes to a professional sports league. Now, the NFL has not went that far. They haven't been advocating for men and women to get on the football field. The NBA hasn't really been pushing for that. But, folks, it's going to get to a point to where you really going to see this happen in professional games. And, folks, it can end in disaster. I mean, biological women should not be on the football field with biological men. I mean, those NFL players, those linemen, they're massive. They're like dinosaurs. It could go very, very badly. But I guess the NHL had to learn the hard way when it comes to having biological men on the ice with biological women. Now, folks, something bad did happen. So check this out over here on the blaze. Transgender hockey tournament promoted by NHL results in biological male player concussing female player. And there is video with this, folks. This female player didn't even last about five seconds on the ice. The female player ended up concuss. And, you know, the, they have all these different weird pronouns here. So we need to get through this thing. But it says here the National Hockey League openly promoted. The trans the team trans draft tournament, which saw a biologically female player concussed by a biological male. The format led to a led to a massive advantage for one team with one attendee citing an enormous difference in player sides, according to the post millennial. The tournament featuring a quote team black versus team pink game included the Boston based team trans organization which describes itself as New England's first LGBTQ plus hockey club. A video posted by Quinlet shows player number 90 on Team Pink described as a bisexual trans woman. Biological man, I'm glad they actually put that out there. Shoving number 91 on Team Black, who describes themselves as female to male, Biological woman, the female player, uh, takes what appears to be a light bump on the ice and then the boards resulting in a concussion. Wow. The start difference in size accounts for the biologically male player absorbing little to no impact from the collision. Additionally, the contact would be illegal in most hockey leagues as a, quote, hit from behind, although the tournament did likely hosts a no contact event. The injured player later uh, commented on Twitter that she has an amazing time with fellow player uh, named Mason. He, him, his, of course, you know, pronouns. A ring size attendee described the scene as displaying an enormous difference in size between the two teams, height, weight, shoulder width, muscles. The differences were plain to even a child. The source told Quinlet, commenting that anyone could see that this couldn't possibly be fair and that someone could get hurt and someone did. So let's go ahead and uh, check out this clip here. Hopefully, hopefully you guys can actually see it. It's a little bit grainy right here, but I'm going to go ahead and play it. You're going to see uh, the female, the biological female player that I guess wants to identify as a male come out through here. And almost goes down immediately. Let's play it. 
Bam. That's it, man. That is it. Lights are out. The player's still down right there. No, no need for the sound anymore. So I turned it off. Yeah, this will happen. A whole what? Two seconds on the ice. And then immediately goes down. Immediately. Bam. Right there. It was only really light contact, guys. Light contact. That was pretty much it. And goes down. Yeah. Somebody got hurt. But you know what? The NHL wants to be virtuous. Wants to be virtuous. And now a biological female got sent to the hospital because of this. Wow. This this is just stunning, guys. Somebody's going to get hurt. We told you guys time and time and time again. But the NHL, hey, pronouns, you know, uh, transgenderism in sports. You know, we're all for it. Gary Bettman, what are you thinking, man? What are you thinking? That's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.